Today, I'm gonna to be going over how to create a Google Ads account. So I am at ads.google.com. This is basically the Google Ads homepage. If you go to ads.google.com, you will come to this page here. If you do not have a Google account already, you can create a Google account from this page, but I highly recommend just going to Gmail, creating a new Gmail account, and using that as your ads account if you don't have a Gmail account already. Once you do, go to ads.google.com, and you'll see here they actually have an offer on the page. They have three different offers on the page, promotional offers. Generally, this one is available for new advertisers where once you spend $500 on advertising within the first 60 days, then you actually get a $500 in ads credit. So I highly recommend taking advantage of this offer. They currently have more offers. They have 1,500 and 3,000. Now, if I was spending 3,000 over the next 60 days, which I'm not in this account, then I would absolutely take advantage of offer C. For right now, I'm gonna take offer A. I will spend my $500 over the next 60 days. Why not? Uh, spend some advertising dollars, get $500 for free, and you know, worth every penny there. So once you do that, what you wanna do is click on start now. Now, I did start this process, so it may bring me to a different page, but you may get into something like this, and basically what you wanna do is create a new Google Ads account. So once we click on start now, we're gonna get into the process of creating this video is brought to you by my Google Ads course. So if you go to surfsideppc.com slash course, you can see my Google Ads course here and purchase it for $34.99. Anyone who purchases my Google Ads course will get the 2025 version for free as well. So you're getting 23 lessons that I just recently recorded in addition to my brand new course that I'll be releasing in 2025. I also have an inbound marketing course here. It's about 10 hours of content that will show you how to drive more traffic to your website and more leads for your business. So go to surfsideppc.com slash course to get access to some of my different courses that I have available. Back to the video. Creating our Google Ads account. This is going to be a Google Ads account that I'm just gonna create for Surfside PPC. So it's gonna say create your first campaign in a few simple steps. Let's click on create our first campaign. I wish they didn't have this as the option because basically what they want is they want for people to call for free ad setup help. Do not do this. Google is not helpful for you. Google will put you on the phone with a salesperson who is going to set up your account with the wrong settings, not your account. They'll set up your campaign with the wrong settings, settings that suit Google and not you generally. So I would highly recommend not ever calling the Google ads representatives or going through Google ads and watching helpful videos from other people that are there to help you. So what is my business name? We are just going to do Surfside PPC. What is my website? I will just say surfsideppc.com. This video is not going to be about creating a Google ads campaign. It's really about going through creating your first campaign, pausing it. We're just going to keep skipping all of this and we're gonna leave campaign creation. So I would highly recommend doing that. You don't need to launch a campaign when you start your Google Ads account. I usually recommend setting up conversion tracking after you set up your billing. That should be your very first step. So it's gonna make us set up our billing here. So my billing country is United States. You can adjust this for wherever you are located, whatever time zone you are located in, and whichever currency that you're using. So these three do suit me correctly. So let's go to continue. Okay, confirm your account and payment settings. So United States, New York time, we have our promotion already active. So I need to spend $500 by January 14th. That is no problem. Do I want personalized guidance from a Google ads expert? No, okay, so payments profile. I'm going to create my payments profile now. This is going to be something I kind of skip through a little bit so I don't show my payment details to anybody. So let's set up our payment profile here. Basically, either organization or individual, either one is perfectly fine. So that's where you want to get started. Okay, I'm just setting up mine as an individual for right now. Payment method, I'm going to add my payment method here. Okay, I set up my payment method there. You'll see it's gonna say you'll be charged on the first of each month or anytime your balance exceeds an amount known as your billing threshold. What happens a lot of times is your billing threshold becomes $500. Every time you spend $500 in Google Ads, they are going to charge your card $500. If you don't reach that balance, then you're gonna be charged on the first of each month whatever your balance is if you did not reach that threshold. So it may be $350, for example, that you end up getting charged if you don't hit that $500 threshold. So now we're gonna click on submit, move on to the next step. Okay, it's that simple. My account was created. To start running your ads, you'll need to complete advertiser verification. This helps Google ads verify every advertiser, giving people more transparency, choice, and control. So that is something that we're gonna have to set up. So I would highly recommend going through the advertiser verification now. So basically, is your organization an advertising agency? I'm gonna say yes. 
I want to verify my agency today and we want to click on save and continue. So you want to go through this process. That is definitely something that I would highly recommend doing for the advertiser verification. From here, we have my billing profile set up. My account is set up. So it's going to say create a cross channel performance max campaign. Do not recommend doing that. If you have no clue what you're doing in Google ads, you definitely want to watch more tutorials. I have a lot on my channel. There are plenty of other channels that are very helpful. They have a get started list, get the Google ads mobile app, view your optimization score, learn more and explore your account overview. So basically the next step for us is going to be setting up our conversion tracking, setting up our campaigns and going over every little detail in Google ads. So I will be doing that. So thank you for watching my video today. This is how we set up our Google ads account. Very simple process, create account set up billing, you'll get right in here, complete the advertiser verification, and you should have no problem with your Google ads account. So thank you for watching my video today and make sure you subscribe to the Surfside PPC YouTube channel.